Good morning, this is Rich from Rich to be Live. Good afternoon, good evening, depending on where in the world you are. I have some breaking news for Montoro. Montoro receives NI43101 report on Wichita North BC Canada Rare Earth Element Re Project. This is breaking news. It's just off the presses. Wichita North Re Project, British Columbia. International Montoro Resources, IMT in Canada, further to our news release of April 11th, 2019, has received the NI43101 report on the Wichita North property located in the Caribou Mining Division, BC, adjoining the well-known Wichita Rare Earth Minerals Discovery. The company contracted Robert A. Bob Lane of Vernon, BC to complete the NI43101 report. He is the geologist. Conclusions and recommendations. Mr. Robert Bob Lane reports the property has the potential to host and should continue to be explored for rare earth element remineralization because it occurs within a favorable geological belt known to contain carbonatite hosted Remineralization, such as main zone on the Wichita Defense Metals Corp. property located approximately 10 kilometers to the southeast. Although past exploration of the property was minimal, covering only the northeast part of the claims, it did identify several geo geophysical anomalies and one geochemical anomaly worthy of follow-up. Therefore, a comprehensive phase one exploration program consisted of reprocessing and reinterpretation of the airborne geophysical data and 3D inversion modeling, currently being conducted by Campbell and Walker Geophysics Limited of North Vancouver, BC, prospecting and bedrock mapping and rock, silt, and soil sampling is warranted and recommended. The report titled Wichita North Rare Earth Element Project by Robert A. Bob Lane, Plateau Minerals Corp., dated April 26, 2019, will be posted to CEDAR and to the IMT website at montororesources.com ASAP. You can see an image right there. Wichita North Helicopter Born Aero Tem Survey 210 electromagnetic response. The claim broke block comprises four continuous MTO cell claims that cover approximately 1,444 hectares of which a portion of the claim area was previously flown in 2010 by AeroQuest when previously owned by IMT. It consisted of 654 line kilometers of Aero Tem helicopter borne time domain electromatic, electromagnetic plus radiometric surveying flown at high resolution 50 meter line spacing. Bob Lane has extensive experience in this area as he previously managed the adjacent Wichita 19 hole drilling projects in 2008 and 2009 for spectrum mining and recently assisted the compilation of completion of a 41 NI43101 technical report for first legacy mining, now Defense Metals Corp on the TSX.V under the symbol DEFN. This is the 43101 disclosure, Robert A. Bob Lane, a qualified person as defined by National Instrument 43101, has reviewed and approved the technical information above in this news release. The financing. The management of the company is recommending completion of a BC super flown through financing. So exploration can commence as soon as the seasonal road access is open and property conditions and accessible are accessible for sampling and are recommended and the recommended work program. An announcement is forthcoming upon TSX Venture Exchange acceptance of the property acquisition agreement. This is huge news. This is breaking news. 43101 has been issued and that is like gold. Okay. So I wouldn't be surprised to see some movement here for IMT. 
about International Montoro Resources, Inc. In February 2019, Montoro entered into an acquisition agreement with various vendors to acquire claims in the Caribou Mining Division, British Columbia, and is proceeding to exchange approval on the Wichita North claims, 1,444 hectares, adjoining the well-known Wichita Rediscovery. Montoro will continue to focus on advancing its 100% owned Serpent River, Elliott Lake, Northern Ontario, Pecor's Magnetic Anomaly, a potential NI. It's got this adjoining the well known Wichita Discovery. Montoro will continue to focus on advancing its 100% owned Serpent River, Elliott Lake, Northern Ontario, Pecor's Magnetic Anomaly, a potential NI coup. CUPGE Discovery. The southwestern portion of the property has located uranium remineralization from previous drilling in the general area where Rio Algom discovered uranium. The property comprises 10 mineral claims, 115 units, or approximately 1,840 hectares. In February 2018, Montoro received approval for the acquisition of the Dunhamel Quebec property. The NICU Co. prospect consisted of nine mineral claims comprising 500 hectares. Additional staking of 32 adjoining mineral claims and compiling of data has been underway since February, and the expanded property now totals approximately 2,300 hectares and prospected for titanium, vanadium, and chromium. In addition, the company owns... Jointly with Belmont Resources Inc. 50-50, it's Cracking Stone, 982 hectares, 2,427 acres, uranium properties in the Uranium City District, Northern Saskatchewan, and is seeking a joint venture partner to continue development of this advanced property. This is on behalf of Gary Musil, President, CEO, and Director of this Montero resources. Huge news, breaking news. Love to know what you guys think about this news. This is the type of news that anyone that's investing in resource companies likes. And this is the type of news that a lot of investors in international Montoro resources have been waiting for. So I'm gonna to continue to research this. I'm gonna to continue to do more due diligence stay tuned. I am looking to actually have them on the show later today. I'll keep you updated on that. So as soon as we go live and we do the show, it'll be around 8 a.m. Pacific time. I would like to speak with one of the representatives from International Montero Resources about this breaking news. So stay tuned. I'll let you know when I'm live, probably around 8 a.m. Pacific, 11 a.m. Eastern. This is your boy Rich from Rich TV Live, International Montoro resources with breaking news it's true what do you guys think this is your boy rich from rich tv live and i'm out peace montero receives ni 43101 report on wichita north bc canada rare earth element re project it's true <laughs>